Hello and good evening. Well, we're at the end of day 22 um, of Vlogmas Australian Edition. It's been a busy day. I had a lot of plans for today uh, and none of them turned out the way I wanted them to, which was a bit disappointing, but that's the way the cookie crumbles, isn't it? Anyway, we are on day 22, as I said, I just said that, um, of our advent calendars, which means we only have two days to go. That's a bit sad, isn't it? So what did I do today? Well, probably the biggest thing I did today was listed one of my project cars to be sold. So I've got two project cars. Um, and yes, one of them has to go because I can't fit two of them at the new house. And one of them I've really lost interest in. So that'll be the one that has to go. So I've put it up on um, two specialty car groups that are, you know, specific to those that make a model of vehicle. Um, and I've already had, I've got six people at the moment that are interested and it's been up for probably about four hours. So that's good. Um, hopefully that'll go before the move. I'd say it, it will. Um, yeah. Yeah. So that'll be good. That'll be some money towards the move as well, which will which is great. Um, what else? I've started packing my clothes and my shoes. I might have a few shoes. Hmm, don't we all have a few shoes? <laughs> um, so yes, um, also tackled a cupboard in the hallway and discovered that we have a bit of a fetish for batteries gaffer tape, extension cords. So all three of those were in multiples in this particular um, chest, uh, draw, drawer set in the hallway. So that was interesting to go through today. <laughs> um, it's like anything. Once you start opening drawers, you realise that you've got three drawers that all have the same thing in it. How did that happen? Anyway anyway um so yes you know the packing is going well the hallway is currently full of empty boxes ready for packing um chris spent the day out doing the yard so that's all been done and he also um repositioned the vehicle for me so it was more readily accessible for people who wanted to come and have a look um and went and bought a new battery for it. Hmm. Actually, if I'd have taped all those batteries I found today, maybe I could have made my own battery. Anyway, that's enough of my rambling. Um, oh, we had dinner with the kids tonight. We went over and had a nice easy dinner um, with Marty and Dylan and Lincoln. Um, so that was nice. That was good. We usually have dinner on a Thursday with my aunt across the street, Robin. Hello, Robin. Um, and she always makes dessert, which is fabulous. Um, so we had to share tonight because usually the leftovers stay at our house. <laughs> yeah, they didn't. They stayed there. That's disappointing. Anyway um okay let's get on with it i only wanted this to be a quick one tonight because i'm a bit tired i probably look a bit frazzled and worse for wear but that's that's how it is that's just how it is um so let's let's get going let's let's see what kylie's got for us today because kylie she never under delivers never we are going for oh four is open so it must be three so three, we have a lovely vase of flowers there. So isn't that nice? Let's have a look what our vase of flowers has in store for us. Oh, yes. Actually, it's, it's funny when you're in the shop um, 
or you're, you're somewhere and someone asks you, oh, where did you get that from? Where did you buy that? And you say, well, actually, I made it, thank you. And it's better than bought. Because <laughs> 95% of the time it probably is. We've all seen, you know, I don't know about you, and I know that a lot of you do, go in and have a look at the clothes on the racks and the, you immediately go and turn them inside out and go and start looking at all the seams and the finishes and what the fabric is, what the construction is and what the fabric is. And it's like, I'm not paying that for that. Anyway, so Andrea at Beyond the Pink Door, no doubt, no doubt she is going to have something awesome in store for us. Oh, I couldn't get it open for a moment there. So number 22, oh, look at that. There we go. That's all that's in there. Number 22, two little ducks, 22. Here we go. Oh, and there, I think there's, hmm, what are they supposed to be? Two little reindeer, maybe? Do you think that's what that might be? Two little reindeer, 22? Anyway, they're fabulous. Mm. There's two of whatever they are. So these are from um, Created by Karis, which is a supplier that Andrea has used before previously in her um, boxes. So they are little magnetic clips. Now, uh, oh. so they've got um, sewing themed pictures on them. Actually, I wonder if I can hold both of them at the same time. Now, I'm not sure if perhaps they're, because they're magnetic, so I'm not sure if they're perhaps bookmarks or maybe needle minders. Um... I'm probably going to go with bookmarks, actually. There is a little ticket here. Oh. Well, I'm not going to show you what it says because there's a discount code on there. Um, so it's crafted by Karis. I'll put a link in the description box. Um, yes, I am hoping that either of my um, guesses are going to be correct. I'll have to go and watch someone else's vlog and see if they knew, or maybe even have a look online at um, Andrea's Facebook page. So they're little magnets. They clip together. So I, I'm, I'm going with um, bookmarks, which are fa fabulous. I love them. I think they're great. Um, I wonder if I could use them to remember when to put my labels in. I could possibly like use it to mark the page where the instructions are for when to put the label in. It's an idea. I might try that. Anyway, on to Wattle Hill Fabrics. Now let's have a look how many have we got in here. Okay, so I still have three small items and then I have a large item on the bottom. So that is obviously going to be for Christmas Day. So let's go for, let's go for this one. So we've gone for this smaller one. Oh. 
possibly a tape measure i'm not sure sort of round but then there seems to be a bobbly bit or something on the on the end we will know momentarily oh well i was right have a look at that have a look at that isn't that cool <laughs> Oh, and you press his little nose. <laughs> That's so cool. So I think he's a um, little doggy. That's really cool. So we have, so it's in centimetres and inches. Oh, goodness. So it's 60 inches or 150 centimetres. So that's a decent size um, little tape measure. How cute is that? That's really cute. <laughs> Thank you, Susie. And then finally, there's no more surprises today. No more mysterious fabric deliveries. Um, our last but not least for the advent calendars is our Dahlia Society one. And we are going for day 10. Yes. So we've got three left here. And we are on day 10. Ooh. Possibly a candle, maybe, or a jar of something. My schnoz is still not working, so all that sniffing was just on the off chance. Oh, oh, so if it's, oh, oh, I might just reverse back. I don't think it's um, a candle after all. I wonder if this is edible. And I wonder if it's a Christmas edible and it is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> now, I'm actually not a big fan of Christmas pudding um, or dark fruit cake. Um, however, this Christmas pudding, I can definitely get all over. Dark chocolate orange with Contro. That is going to be wonderful. Yum, yum, yum. Seriously, I don't know what all these ladies are going to do next year. I don't know how they can top these advent calendars. And any other company that's putting out advent calendars, I can tell you now that the bar is set very, very high. So that's it. That's it for day 22 of Vlogmas. It's also the summer solstice here in Australia. So it's the longest day of the year today. Um, I had wonderful plans to actually go through a um, solstice ritual with you, but things just didn't work out that way today. So unfortunately that hasn't been the case, but you know, now that I've let it all out here, um, there's room for that in the future. There's always another day. There's always a tomorrow. We'll get there. We'll get there. If you're interested, you know, don't let me force anything on you. Um, and you can always skip a video if you don't like the content. There's always that. We do have freedom of choice, don't we? Anyway, that is it for Thursday, the 22nd of December. Day 22 of Vlogmas Australian Edition. Um, join me here tomorrow for day 23. It's the day before the day before Christmas. It's Christmas Eve Eve. Actually, tomorrow I'll be over with a little man, but then in the afternoon I will begin the preparations for Christmas specifically my trifle so maybe I'll bring you along for that we'll see anyway have a great evening and I'll see you tomorrow bye